I want to share with you an item that uh, I tried that didn't make it to market. It didn't work, but I thought it was great at the time, but uh, I was obviously wrong. But these are famous bites. These are, um, these are dog toys. And I, you can see, I, I kind of went overboard. I did 12 styles. But at the time, uh, Jimmy, with the inflatables were really taking off. And uh, I had a hard time getting the salespeople to, uh, to try to find, because this is a buyer that we didn't deal with. This is a pet supply buyer or, pet, or companies like Petco and PetSmart that we didn't deal with. So I had a hard time actually getting these placed. I ended up doing a lot of the calls myself. Uh, and got samples to Petco, PetSmart, Walmart, and people like that, but they didn't end up buying it. Okay, what kind of st st stimulated this was uh, when I was in Chicago, when I was in retail, I remember buying a dog toy, like a little Gorbachev doll, a little plastic Gorbachev doll, it looked like Mikhail Gorbachev, and it was great. You know, we kept telling our dog, go get Gorbachev, go get Gorbachev, and I thought, well, it would be funny just to make, uh, you know, famous history characters, and we called them Famous Bites. So you can see from the uh, the hang tag, called them famous bites. They have a little bite mark out of the um, out of the hang tag. Um, and again, we did twelve styles, so I'll go through them. We had Teddy Kennedy, uh, Hillary Clinton. Uh, this is like early to mid two thousands that we did this. George Bush is probably the worst sculpt. All the other sculpts are pretty good. George Bush, Bush didn't look that great. Bill Gates. You've got Beethoven, you got Einstein. Einstein, one of the things about all these characters, they're all public domain. There's no licensing fee because they're historical characters or they're public figures. Found out later that Einstein actually is a license. So I would have gotten in a little bit of trouble with Einstein because he, uh, for some, he is, they, they do, his family does license his name. So we have Fidel Castro, we had Prince Charles, we had Queen Elizabeth, we had Julius Caesar, we had Genghis Khan, you had Napoleon. So they were really funny. They were uh, cute characters. Thought they'd make great dog toys, but just didn't have any luck getting them into the market. Um, now, one thing, uh, these would have been safe. I, I, I won't give these to my dog currently because I don't know what kind of paint they use. And who knows how much lead is in the paint here. But, uh, uh, but if we would have gone into production, it would have been you know safe for dogs. But these things probably aren't. So this is just an example, you know, they can't all be winners. You know, some items work, some items don't. I thought this one would really work. I thought it was a great idea. I was wrong, uh, but uh, I tried. And, uh, you know, so now you're seeing something uh, that was created that never made it to market. Thanks.